I suppose this is one question that all fishermen want to know is what would be the effects on other fish? Now, you've got Murray cod, you've got Australian bass, yellow belly, like priority species like that. Well, so the work by the CSIRO, um, this has been pretty much the main focus of this research over the last eight years. What they wanted to do is ensure that Australian native species are safe from this virus. It's really important. What they did is they basically took um, example species from um, all of the taxonomic orders of fish that occur in estuarine water or freshwater and co-occur with carp. So uh, they've tested all those species and what they did is they, they got some infected water and they bathed those species in the water. They also um, injected those fish with uh, the virus in quite high concentrations to be really sure that they won't develop the disease and then they observed them for a period of time. Um, and it was really promising to see that the only species that, caused, that developed the disease caused by this virus was common carp. Like I say, because this is a herpes virus, we really expected that it would be specific to common carp, but it's fantastic to see the research confirming that.